The CPF Board has several schemes which members can tap on to grow their CPF savings. We accept voluntary contributions to Medisafe. We also allow CPF members to make cash top-ups or CPF transfers to their special account or retirement account. They can also do so for their loved ones. 2020 saw a record amount of top-ups via the Retirement Sum Topping Up Scheme. This amounts to about $3 billion across 140,000 members. To make it easier for members to build up their CPF savings through these schemes, we will refine the relevant tax relief and top-up limit rules. Let me elaborate further. Currently, members can enjoy tax relief when topping up via these schemes, but the rules in place are different. To align the rules for both schemes, tax relief for voluntary contributions to Medisafe account for employees will be provided to the giver instead of the recipient. From the 1st of January 2022, givers can also look forward to an annual tax relief cap of $8,000 when they make cash top-ups to their own CPF accounts and another $8,000 when they do so for their loved ones, up from $7,000. This cap will be shared between the Retirement Sum Topping Up Scheme and Voluntary Contributions to Medisafe Account for Employees. To facilitate planning for members, we will also simplify the top-up limit for voluntary contributions to Medisafe Account. Today, the limit for employees depends on two sets of figures, the basic healthcare sum and the CPF annual limit, which is the maximum amount of mandatory and voluntary contributions a member can receive in a calendar year. As members can only know whether they have reached the annual limit at the end of each year, this creates some uncertainty for members. Therefore, going forward, the top-up limit for employees will be simplified to depend only on the basic healthcare sum.